Hey folks, I'm Lady, and this is First 15, where I bring you the first 15 minutes of the latest games releasing on Xbox Game Pass. Today, we're playing Warhammer 40k Bolt Gun. It's a retro first-person shooter set in the Warhammer universe, or with a Warhammer 40k skin, where you play as a space marine decimating waves of demonic creatures. It was published by Focus Entertainment and developed by Auroc Digital, at least that's how I pronounce it. They're an indie studio based in Bristol, and I'm a huge fan of shooters, even when I choose to play them stupidly, I still have a blast, so I'm excited to check this out. Out. Playtime is about 10 hours plus. I'll link to the game in the box. Let's get started. All right. The Emperor protects training for initiates. My armor's contempt, a challenge worthy of the Imperium's mightiest warriors. Emperor's mercy, only veterans will triumph. And Exterminatus, not even a Primarch could survive. I love the pixel art in this. We're just going to go medium. Um, charge, no, no fear, grenades, eviscerate your enemies with explosives, cool. Nothing, once touched by the hand of chaos, remains untainted. You mm. are under the dominion of the Ordo Malleus to assist my investigations into a world that has already felt that damn incident. All right. Briar has been under the close watch of the Inquisition since the Grim Skull War. The Forge world remains largely secure, but we have picked up concerning energy readings in the surrounding system. Mm. I have my suspicions, although we have not had sufficient time to pinpoint the origin of these foul energies. Right, right. While most of the planet remains unaffected, it is my belief that rogue elements within the Adeptus Mechanicus may have been experimenting with a surviving fragment of Inquisitor Drogon's power source. Sure. Your mission is to assist me in locating a fragment of the power source. Mm -hmm. While I consider this threat extremely serious, your superiors have seen fit to second only a handful of you to my supervision. To second? In the absence of a larger force, we should pray to the Emperor that this does not develop into a more dire situation. This servo skull will guide you. <laughs> In Commodus here is one of the few sanctified and preserved from the purging of Drogon's heretical archives. All right. Together, you will search sites where communication has become sporadic. Should you encounter any information, <laughs> oh, I assume they have been tainted by the ruinous powers. Suffer not the heretic to live. I'll suffer no one to live. While I continue my investigations aboard the Crown, you will be deployed to a habitation zone we lost contact with several cycles ago. Mm -hmm. You should assume the situation to be extremely hostile. That's life, man. Life is extremely hostile. We do not know how far the taint of the arch enemy spreads. Don't worry. You can count on me, as I'll just take your word for everything you said. Also, the way she put her hand up, it didn't feel... <laughs> I don't know, it didn't feel like something her character would do. It felt like if she just put her hands on her hip in a sassy way. It just didn't match her voice. Oh. Drop pad landing zone miscalculated. Imperial armory adjacent. Oh, so I'm gonna go in there and get some shit. Okay, so I can jump. Okay. Interesting. All right, and I can melee. Cool. All right, well, I'm hoping that's like health. Let's go up before we go down. What is this? Okay. I'm assuming that there are two things that are lit up there. Okay. Guys, I'm coming, but give me a second. I just want to see what's down here. And I got to say, you know, I wasn't going to play this for First 15 initially because I don't know much about the Warhammer franchise, so I prefer keeping anything related to it in my uncovered videos. But then I saw it was a retro shooter, and, you know, I'm a sucker for 90s throwbacks. Or, you know, a boomer shooter, which only makes sense to the internet because those of us who grew up on games like these obviously aren't boomers. But that's neither here nor there. <laughs> Vertical movement necessary. Jump. I mean, I will say it controls a little. F I don't know what the word is. Controls a little funky. Let me. 
Let me grab this. Not gonna punch those, because I'm pretty sure I know what'll happen. If I do, oh my god! I think I almost fell off! <laughs> hey! Yikes! Oh, also, let me start my 15 minute timer. Yeah, it feels a little clunky. Whoop! But it's fine. Can I just punch this? Oh no, X to activate. Okay. Oh, I see. I see. So holding the left trigger kind of like freezes on them and then allows me to just sort of, oh, I, I need a key to just sort of um, catapult myself to them. That's fun. That's neat. Let's activate whatever that is. I want to say it's like not that the aim is off, but when there are little things like this that I can destroy, it's very hard to direct that, so I can't wait until I actually get a gun. Okay. Uh, rapid charge advised. Haste required. Okay, so I run and then... What? Okay. I just realized this is timed. <laughs> uh, all right, that's why I was saying it. Because I, I didn't get, because I saw the thing that said it needs a charge, I was like, wait, do I have to release some kind of charge and then go? But no. Uh. Yeah, but that was my fault. That was just because of the order in which those things came up. So let's head back here. Yeah, it feels... I don't know. It doesn't feel smooth to play. What the? Yes, give me all the ammo. Let's gaze upon this and its reverence. Nice. Yeah, it doesn't... I don't know. I don't know. I'm not gonna keep saying it, but it doesn't feel good. Uh, but that's fine. Whoop. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Well, anybody else in here? Anything that I can destroy? No? Okay. Somebody shooting at me from over there? Alright, I do like there's a lot of ammo. What is the range on this? Give me this key. Wow, I actually have a lot of range on, um... I was talking about my melee. Like, how far can I use it to go? And actually, the answer seems to be pretty far. Like, that's a fun mechanic, right? Just being able to traverse that quickly. But for these types of games, the feel of the movement and the speed is really important. And I don't feel like I have speed. I feel very, like, labored. Also, I saw that it said the area is sanctified. Thank you for telling me, my little friend. Let us uh, proceed. Oh, level complete. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I'm <laughs> like, I love the visuals and I can tell that I'm going to like a lot of the underlying mechanics that, you know, as things speed up, as things progress, I'm going to get more into the combat than I am right now. The traversal is really, really good. It's just, again, like the movement itself at its core, like the base movement does not feel. Why'd you put your hands up? Were you trying to surrender yourself to me? Because there is no surrender to me. You understand? Uh, there is none. Oh, and I can do, like, a pretty decent dash. Nice. Alright. So we're just gonna barrel through this. Anything up here? Like, do I need to get these things? Oops, I didn't mean to do that.
Like, does that even do anything for me? I don't know. Okay. Up here. How? How I... How I up? Up here first? I can climb. Okay. Blow you up. Oh god. Didn't mean to do that. Please tell me I didn't fall all the way down here. Traversal! Ha! Yeah, like, what is the point of these? Do I even need to look at those? Sorry, friend. Alright, I need to get back up there. What's the fastest way? Um, uh oh. This is the fastest way. Hmm. Ah! <laughs> oh, that was funny. <laughs> the fact that he screamed kind of like made me nervous is why I went back down. I was like, oh, somebody's pretty serious here. Okay. I mean, again, it looks great and, you know, the actual kills are satisfying. It's just the movement is just, I'm not a fan. Where are you, person that's still screaming at me? Oh, in here, maybe? No, because this is how I came back up. Alright, buddy, where do you want me to go? Okay. So, in here. But this is just where I just was, so... Like, this is where I came back up. I got a frag grenade! How do I throw that? The bumper? Where do you where do you want me to go? What? Down there? <gasps> what the hell? Okay. Cogitating, cogitating. Result inconclusive. Interesting. Hi. <laughs> Just give me all this stuff. I want to use a frag grenade. Oh, oh my god. Anybody else? Wow. A key! I don't know where it goes. Huh. Get out of my face. I heard something. <laughs> the way they scream. How do I use a frag grenade? Oh, I see. On the lower right there. It's the left bumper. Oh! I mean, it's, a, it's the left bumper. I meant it's the right bumper. The left bumper is dash. Cool. You're the first person I got to try it on. I got a hundred plus contempt. What is that? Oh. Whoops. I must have let loose a frag and not noticed. Yeah, this definitely, I think, could go for, um... Yeah. For a little bit higher difficulty, for sure. But also more speed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Somebody hitting me from behind. Yes! Sir, can you stop?
Whoops. I don't know where I was shooting there. Um, <clears throat> it's because I was trying to like strafe, but like, like strafe and shoot at the same time. All right. Secret discovered. Did I pick it up? Where was it? Eh? Okay, well. Never mind then. Find an alternate route. Okay. I want a different weapon. I mean, I know it's called bolt gun, so my bolt gun is gonna be, you know, my main baby, but still. Guys, I wanna go in there. Anybody else? Oh, I don't have any more frags. I mean, I did, but... Oh, actually, no, I didn't. They did, though. They just blew themselves up like dumbasses. Give me this. I like the artwork a lot. What does that sound? Oh. <laughs> I thought that was telling me like I didn't have health or something. I discovered another secret. What the hell? Am I deaf all of a sudden? Why did, what did, what, what's going on? Oh, I have a thing. I have something special. Hold on. What does this do? Oh, I see. Okay. Is that like a... I mean, I thought it would be like a one-hit kill sort of thing, but I don't see the purpose of that. Okay, let's not do that. Yeah, I don't know what that power-up was for. I don't know what it did, but let's just proceed. I got a key, did I not? Alright, assume that's like a big max health sort of thing, which is why I can't pick it up. Alright, I discovered another secret. Yeah, like, what is this? Huh! Everyone's dead there. Oh, God! Hi, guys. <laughs> oh, let's see. Almost fell down. It's fine. I don't like how some of them just kind of sit there. Whoops. My aim coming out of the melee sometimes, like, like because I'm trying again to strafe in a way that... I don't think I'm meant to do <laughs> in this. Even though I keep trying. Up! Oh, and look at that. The time is up. And you know what? I think we have definitely seen enough of this. So we can cut this here. Yeah, I love the aesthetic. I like the traversal of, you know, being able to dash that far and also being able to just lock onto targets with your chainsaw. 
I mean, I like that, but I feel like all of those things, being able to chain attacks and, you know, blast people away, like, that would be more fulfilling for me if I like the way the game felt and the way the movement felt. Right now, it just feels like there's something lacking. Again, it feels like it's labored in a way that I'm not used to. But, I mean, it's been so long since I played kind of the retro shooters, like, the way that they used to be, so... For all I know, this is actually how they used to feel <laughs> when I was growing up. Um, but these days I'm used to the ones that have enhancements that allow you to move at super lightning speed. And that for me is what makes games like this fun. Like it's not just the gore and the shooting and the different weapons and the settings. It's the speed of that. And I just don't feel like this has that. But that's fine, because I still think this is a pretty good game. So that was the first 15 of Warhammer 40k Bolt Gun. If you like what you see, you can play it right now on Game Pass. And if you like this series, please like the video to show your support. I'll see you back here soon with another Game Pass release. Until then, thanks so much for watching, and happy gaming!